It's not, because I don't like Cool Whip, so I'm not like into Whip, I don't really care. But this? And it's when you say those kind of things, and I really just can't figure out why we're together. Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back. I feel like I need to say welcome back to me. Welcome back to the vlogs, Mindy. Nice to have you with us. Actually feels like it's been a minute because Brandon was out of town for four days. Then he came back, was here for like a day and a half, but then I did like a field trip and did so many things with the kids that I feel like I was barely in those vlogs, but you guys, I am here. No one's going anywhere anytime soon. Do not plan on getting stranded. And so many of you are like, did you really get stranded? No, I could have obviously chosen to drive home, but we did take bags just in case. And at the time we were like, it's probably better that we stay here rather than drive in the snow. So we were prepped in the off chance that we did decide to stay downtown and it was was the greatest, greatest idea. You guys, everybody needs a friend like Stephanie. She is always down to do whatever. She's always my ride or die. Bad boys for life. She's just amazing. We always have so much fun together. The amount of people that said that we look like sisters kind of warmed my heart. Maybe that means we're both getting older and getting more wrinkles, so we're just starting to look like each other. <laughs> it was such a fun time. Home now, cute Ryler and his friends, they, you guys can see right here over my shoulder, have gone and stocked up on all the pancake waffle things. Ryler said to me last week, he's like, my friends really want to come over for waffles. And I was like, okay. We did this a couple of, maybe like a month or two ago, invited all of his friends over, made a ton of waffles, had a breakfast bar, and it was so much fun. He's like, my friends wanna come over and watch a show and have a waffle bar. I'm like, absolutely, 100%, yes. Tomorrow's an online day, which means they don't have to go to bed super early tonight. We're gonna have a movie night here at the house, make some breakfast for the kids. I'm actually really excited and feel very flattered. I don't have a special waffle recipe. I use crusties. <laughs> I will let them think I'm great all day long. I have to tell you though, a little bit of my mom came out in me today because I just got back from Walmart. One of the stores by us is doing a remote model and they're clearancing out so many things. So many things. I was leaving. I didn't really have time to shop. I saw all the Crayola stuff. This is a $5 set of markers. They were on sale for 50 cents. And then I was like looking at other stuff and I come down and I see this giant box of gift sacks. And they're all like three in one bag set. So it has the bag, a card, a cute card with like embellishments and then tissue paper. It all coordinates and goes together. They were normally $4. They were on sale for 50 cents. I'm short on time. So I started like picking out a couple that I wanted and I was like, I really don't have time to go through this entire box. So what would my mom do? I bought all of them. It was so inexpensive. I cannot tell you. I will say in the last couple of months, every time Ryler has a friend party that he has, I go to CVS, I buy the gift bag with paper and it's $5. I didn't even get a card. So anyways, I had a little moment of weakness. I bought a million gift sacks, but we are well stocked for all the parties now. Little rundown of my morning today. It's been awesome. It's been fantastic. Teeny bit more snow, not much. I'm excited to get the kids home from school. And then we have parent teacher conferences and hosting a breakfast party. I'm excited. I successfully got the bags put away, but as I walked into Brandon's office, I turned my body and I was trying to like walk behind so he wouldn't see me. He's like, what did you do? I explained it to him and he goes, wait a minute, that's actually like a really good deal. And he got super hyped. We counted up, I bought 80 bags. We are good. Brandon doesn't ever get mad about any purchase I make, but sometimes he has to laugh at the things that I do. That one at first, he was like, what? Why are you doing that? And then he's like, wait, he was so excited. He's getting hype on the deals today too. He is downstairs picking up the basement. The boys are actually pretty good about picking up the basement, but tonight, since the kids are coming over to have a full movie night, he's down there cleaning. Who are you? <laughs> Kids are home from school. We are in full prep mode because it is a Thursday. It feels like a Friday. I've been thinking it's yes. Friday all day. Yes. Tomorrow is an online day, which is ironic because yesterday was an online day. You guys have barely gone to school it's this week weird. because Monday was a holiday. So I don't even know why you guys went to school this week. That's Except you gotta keep those brains firing. You gotta learn stuff. Brain. It Especially feels like a fun weekend because Rye guys having some friends over tonight. And I say some, I mean, we're talking a pretty full blown party going on here at the house. It's Something that we've come to appreciate, enjoy, and love hosting some of the fun. Crew might be bringing some friends over. Hazy might be Brex, who knows. Rye guys. We kind of got the main event going on yeah. in the theater. <laughs> what theater? <laughs> Hidden surprise if you didn't know. We're gonna watch a fun movie tonight. So in anticipation of that, we were doing some cleaning and preparing, cleaning up the basement. We don't want to get too messy, but I was out of town. Mom allowed popcorn in the theater. Yeah. I had to go double check for any popcorn kernels that may be left behind. It's actually pretty much spotless. Probably some gaming to be going on. Some hanging out here in the basement. Maybe some ping pong action at the ping pong yeah. table. So Raga and I just cleaning up a little bit of that, vacuuming around the pistachio tables as we call them. Actually, we don't call them that ever. Also, on top of that, today more and more things going on. Mom probably already told you, but we do have parents 
parent-teacher conferences. Not for you though, right? No. So there's no way this party can be taken away. Yeah. Okay, good. And then we do have them for Brex and for Hazy, and we have three kids in piano today. While mom goes to the parent-teacher conferences, I'm gonna be taking kids to piano. Raga continues to prepare to host friends. Doing a waffle bar tonight. Should be awesome. Mom went and got a ton of groceries, a lot of fun. I don't know, just extra mixins to make yep. it extra special for Raga. Excited, gonna be a fun night. Love doing this here at our house and yeah. kicking off the weekend what feels like a day early. Yeah. Kids, you ready for piano? Yeah. Okay, we'll I have a new bag right now. You got so. a brand new bag that mom got you, and I wasn't here for your first piano lesson, so I get to take you to your second one. Should you go load up and go to your piano lesson? Yeah. Look at that, you've been practicing so much, Hazel. Mom is back from a parent-teacher conference. Hazy is back from piano. Waffle party's about to go down, so she's slicing up some strawberries, getting out the raspberries. Ready. We've got all kinds of stuff back there. First, got the two in the hot seat right now. How was parent-teacher conference? Parent-teacher conference was awesome. <gasps> For both? For both of them. No negative reports, which there's not usually. There and never has there been, ever. And if there is, ever. it's like, a lot of friends and they talk a lot. I like to be social, uh, and guess what? So, That's a skill. That's good. I know. I used to be like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. But now I'm just like, I'm so grateful that my kids <laughs> have that skill. As they long as they're friends. respectful, not disrespecting yes. teachers, letting them teach their lesson, but if they got friends and they're chatty, that's good. Both teachers said it doesn't matter where they put you in their class, you guys make friends with everyone and you're nice to everyone. Guys, that's fantastic. What a great report, I even know. beyond scholastic accolades, the fact that you can be kind to everyone and anyone and make friends with anyone. That's huge. That's really, amazing. Really, they both did really good. Awesome. Good How are you guys? Job. Okay, for your reward, Yay. you get waffles tonight. Yes. <laughs> Mom is getting the pancakes going here. Sorry. So many extras going on. We've got bananas, raspberries, strawberries. You can hear some of the chaos going on downstairs. The friends, the kids have arrived. We've got hazelnut spread, which is Nutella. Cheap, great value version. <laughs> then we went with name brand on the Biscoff. That's right you butter. Now. Cinnamon Toast Crunch spread is amazing. Never get tired of that. What else do we have, Mom? Coconut cream? Okay. Bought that one. It's the same brand. You can get the double pack of this one, like cinnamon, cinnamon bun, bun and syrup. the buttermilk. Interesting. I want to try this coconut, coconut. cream. Coconut. It's coconutty. Fruity Pebbles. That's a fun one I got for Christmas, actually. <laughs> Random. And then original. Gotta have some original. Who's I, a big original my fan? favorite's original. Then bring it over this way, you guys. We've got chocolate milk, orange juice, apple juice. We are, oh, yogurt and we got a yogurt parfait bar? Mom. Yeah. Are you trying to earn a reputation for the breakfast for dinner, Mom? Sure am, because <laughs> if you feed them, they, they will come. come. Wasn't this a kid requested night? Not our kids. Oh. Kids' friends. The kids' said, friends. Mama B. I don't know they call they you, call but. Me Mama B. <laughs> they said, Will you make another waffle night? Will you another waffle night? I'm like, If we become known for that, I am all about that. Yeah, waffle night. There's one house? thing I want to be known <laughs> for it's food. We could be the next Waffle House. <laughs> now, if you've never been to a Waffle House, just imagine a gas station bathroom that sells waffles. Yogurt Party Bar, I'm going to be breaking into that one for sure because it just looks delish. I love it. But where's like the sugar, brown sugar, added sugar? Yeah. Not enough sugar. More sugar. This is a Bingham house, Mindy. I know. Did you just see that little flipsy do I did with this double waffle maker? Whoa. Oh, I think I didn't. This is like my favorite. I'm so I, used to being impressed I by actually, you. Actually, if this is gonna be a thing we do, I'm gonna buy a second one of these. <gasps> double and you can have makers. four waffles going at a time, Mindy. So I brought out Snoopy. He's gonna help me tonight. Thank you. So you got three going at a time here. Now, if in fact you were in need of some more waffle making material, Mindy, we do have the ability to tap into our all waffle maker drawer. Wait, what are these things? Are those little mini waffles? They're baby ones. I thought you were coming minis. over here to showcase the homemade whipped okay, cream. Okay. So I at made. the same time, well, you really are showing off tonight, Mindy. Also making homemade. Whoop. Whoop cream. Oh my whoop. Whoop. It's my favorite. It's so Brandon good. Brandon one time was trying to convince me how big of a okay. waste of time Not and energy. one time. <laughs> Every time up until last time when I had some and I was like, whoa, that's different. <laughs> it's not because I don't like cool whip. So I'm not like into whip. I don't really care. But this. I, when you say those kind of things, I really just can't figure out why we're together. I could take a bath in this. <laughs> <laughs> this is homemade whipped cream. I'm working out a process right here. I'm working out a process. I don't know what I'm doing. I just dropped the strawberries. What a night, holy Waffles cow. Waffles were, what's the word? Screaming, bussing, scrumptious? Looking for scrumptious? <laughs> a word that starts with S that. Super good. Apparently it's bedtime. Got almost all the kids out there. I think there's only one left of the big soiree. <laughs> you did not have a soiree, that's what you went to. We had a big get together and it was fun. Yeah. My guy just told me he had a lot of fun. They did a bunch of different things. Crew had a friend over. I just got back from taking Crew's friend home. The roads Is it are snowing again? insane. No. Coming up our street, I was like, 
No I was way. not even trying. We got another storm coming, folks, so. Wow, you know what? It's still winter, Groundhog <laughs> says. <laughs> Despite that, we're gonna still have some serious fun at this weekend, which is kicking yeah. off a little early with an online Friday tomorrow, going into the weekend. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. We love you so much. Thanks, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye. <laughs>